Hi, this is Ginger. I wanted to share with you a mini I made for my partner, Aretha. First, I created this, I built this house out of chipboard and embellished it to house the album. Used die cuts for the windows and the wreath. I did some stamping. Here's a Tim Holtz, the lamp post on each end. And I used stickles and wrote Merry Christmas on the roof. I love I love how the box turned out. And the roof hinges back. And pull the album out. I used a combination of paper bags and chipboard pages throughout this album. The paper line I used was the MME Lost and Found Christmas. Mm. On the side here I've got a tag that says Merry Christmas and a key and a little charm that says Believe. And the cover is an acrylic cover. I used my snowflake stencil with the special effects paste. And I did the snowflakes and the gold on the front and green on the back. And used liquid pearls on the centers. And there's a first page. I don't know if you can tell, but there's glossy accents on parts of it. And there's my tags. One of my tags. Music sheet. I just embellished that with some SEI trees. There's a little photo frame. Put a little picture in. Here is another a little book that pulls out of this page. It's a little book you could make out of envelopes. It opens like this. And there. Then you turn it. It opens like that. And that. And you turn it one more time. And it opens like that. And in the, there's top pockets. There's openings in the top for the top pockets. And I took tags and just tea stained them and stamped on them and just ripped some fabric and made ties. And I just used, I made a little pocket out of a plastic sheet and used eyelets to secure it down and heat embossed snowflakes on that page. Here's my next page. This is one of my favorites. I've seen a YouTube video of a lady who just, who took a piece of paper and tore it down the middle and rolled it back and then hole punched and fed her string. You can use string or yarn down there. I love that. And in that pocket there's a couple tags. There's a chipboard page. And I used my uh, ornament die I had to make 
little frame. And on this page, I have stained uh, a doily, and I have a little metal snowflake filigree and the, a brand that attaches it. And here's a couple more tags. And on this page is an, another little book that opens. And there's pockets on each side. Here's little tags. I stamped sayings on one side. Journaling spots on the other. And then it opens to another page with two spots. Board. I just used a felt flower, a paper flower, and a little, I think they're called Prima flowers. A little Santa page. And on this page it says, making a list. And the tag says, checking it twice. Here is a chipboard page I made. It's um, if you've ever seen cards made, the shaker cards they make. This I just made a shaker page. I used my Stampin' Up Christmas Lodge stamp set for that page. I used that postcard stamp and made a pocket. more tags these are the tags are Tim Holt stamps and on this page I had used my reindeer border punch and made a little pocket for her to put a photo down in here. I don't know if you can tell, but I used my red liquid pearls for the nose and glittered all the antlers. So cute. There's another tag. Another chipboard. I just got a little felt tree. Here's some more of that Tim Holtz stamps that I made tags with. Another flower I made. The one where you burn the edges on each layer. On this chipboard page, I used another stencil, my brick stencil, and uh, 
made the bricks and it says down the chimney, down the arrow. I love that page too. Little snowflake. And I used a transparency then and I stamped an image on it for a pocket for the photo to fit down in. On this page, I used a chipboard snowflake and a snowflake brand to create the pocket for that photo tag. This page is um, an SEI envelope. I just hole punched and turned it into a page so that she'll be able to open that. And she could put whatever she wants in the po in the pocket. On the back side of the envelope, I used a burlap page and uh, used my Stampin' Up top die note to cut that center out, stamp that scenery, and cut out that image of the skaters. I really like that page too. There's another transparency. For a pocket, I use little jingle bell brads. There's a photo tag for journaling. And the back cover is reindeer. Thanks for watching.